Right, what's going on everyone, Mr. Here, hope you're all doing absolutely fantastic today as always, staying happy, healthy, and hydrated, and welcome back to another episode of GTA 5 Ultimate, Ultimate Zombie Apocalypse Survival. Now, this is episode 4, uh, I just quickly want to say, I already gave away something there, uh, <laughs> I always give away stuff, uh, yeah, I'm just too excited, but yeah, if you haven't watched, uh, from episode 1 to 3 already, up to this one, I, I, I recommend watching the first all the way through, um, otherwise you can just hang out and watch this one. But, uh, yeah, so, what I want to say is, if you did watch the last episode, you, you'd know Michael and Franklin both died, okay? They, they both died, unfortunately. But that's not true, okay? That's the thing. It's, it's kind of cool. So, what happened was, okay, if you remember, down there, down there on the street, we, we, we saw some enemy survivors, we had to fight them, and unfortunately, Franklin died to a zombie. And then Michael, <laughs> he drowned in a swimming pool. But this, okay, this is a cool thing, right? So, Mike, uh, Fr Franklin was actually returned to us, and he is alive. So apparently, not apparently, these friendly survivors came back to the house. I almost shot them because I, I wasn't sure exactly what their intentions were. I, I thought they were coming here to just kind of raid my stuff. And this is Franklin's house, so I wanted to protect that, even though I thought he was passed away. But what happened was, they bring us to him, and one of their survivors had medical experience, they, they were a doctor, uh, prior to the, <laughs> to the apocalypse, and, uh, they bring him back, he wasn't in fact dead, and they, I, I don't know, they didn't speak of a cure or anything, but they said they fixed him up, patched him up, he doesn't remember exactly what happened, but the weird thing is, okay, they gave me some information, so, so obviously he was on the ground, they were, they were fixing him up and whatnot, I'm not sure what else they did, but in my phone right here, they wrote some stuff down, and uh, they can't send a text because there's no signal. But I put it in my notes in my phone. He, during, when they were fixing him up, he was, <laughs> Franklin. Franklin was talking about some real weird stuff, apparently. And they gave it to me, and I wrote it down in my notes. And it turned out to be coordinates. So, we are going to head to those coordinates today. Now, quickly, just to, just to let you know, what happened with Franklin was, <laughs> it was actually a prank. Even though in the end of the episode, I thought he was dead, and then I ended the stream, it turned out to be a prank. Uh, he let me know that he, had, he was actually a, a professional freediver back in the day, and he was holding his breath. He didn't actually die. Uh, <laughs> so that's pretty cool, okay? I thought I was going to have to go through this whole thing by myself, but I, I got my friends back. It's really good. So, uh, yeah. If you're excited for this episode, make sure to leave a like, and if you want to see more like this in the future, uh, yeah, just subscribe. We just hit 2,000. Hopefully, we can hit 5,000 by the end of this year or, like, early start of next year. Yeah, that'll be awesome. Anyway, let me quickly read chat before we, uh, go to these coordinates. Raphael and Cosponis. Hey! Raphael says, lovely content. Content. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. Sorry if I'm messing up my words a bit. I have sinus issues, okay? So sometimes I get a bit of a blocked nose. But, um, yeah, so the coordinates that he told us were... Where was it? It was near Zancudo. This is Zancudo over here, isn't it? Yeah. And I think it was down here somewhere. Just between, like, all this area right here, this swampy area. Um, so I guess we can head over there. I mean, I'm not sure what to expect, because it was just random coordinates that, uh, they didn't even figure out were coordinates. They were just thought, he's speaking some gibberish, we better write it down just in case. Turns out it's coordinates, and they figured out, uh, like, uh, like how to write the coordinates, like, uh, the, the exact coordinates, not just a random bunch of numbers. And they, they, they went and had a look and confirmed that this is, in fact, an area that they think would be interested in, so. So, uh, I thought we'd definitely go over there. Bro, please open the minimap. I might, it's just... I feel like, uh... I feel like things look a lot more nicer without the minimap. Because if I have the minimap, it's kind of not realistic. When... In a... In a real situation, you're more likely to have an actual map. The minimap, I feel like, just kind of... Hogs some space on the... On the screen. Um, but if enough other people end up... Wanting it, then, uh... Yeah. I don't know, I just feel like it looks a lot nicer with less things on the screen. So yeah, let's uh, let's head over there. I mean, look at this, it's raining today. I think this is the first rainy episode we've had. Oh my gosh, there's so many zombies already. Look at that. That is... Michael is back and better than ever. He actually never died, but uh, Franklin's been a bit quiet. He's not really talking that much. Uh, but yeah, we're definitely gonna have to do a bunch of zombie hunting today. Uh, and, uh, but I, I really want to check out what these coordinates are. Actually, before we get there, 
I need to make sure I definitely have enough stuff because I don't want to go there and get stuck in a situation and not have food. Okay, we got food. Got a bit of water. We can cook water or boil water next to a fire, so that's all right. We're a bit low on fuel, though, so... So, yeah. Got to keep an eye out for that. All right. So, we'll take a bit of a shortcut right here. Go down here. I mean, I don't expect there to be many zombies down right here unless they've just wandered off. They'll probably just be on the main roads and stuff. Um, so we'll take a bit of a shortcut. I kind of want to avoid zombies. Just just feel like we're back in the normal life for a little bit at least. I'm not sure what to expect. Okay, no, they're all down here. They're all down here. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, man. Well, we're running low on fuel a little bit, but uh, that's all right. It's all right. We'll get there. The journey that matters, not the destination. Although the destination is unknown. So it's a little bit scary, but... But, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll keep going. Keep going. <clears throat> Alright, okay. Oh, I apologize. I thought there was no wall there. I could just drive around. So I think we're getting closer. It should just be just over there. Yeah, we're right here. This is looking perfect. You know what I would think would be cool? Is if there was an actual, a little, like a, like a, I could actually hold a map that I could bring up instead of the phone or something. I think that would be a pretty easy mod to make. Just replace the phone with a map. I think that's, I think that's doable, but I don't think it's been done yet. That would be really cool. So uh, yeah, let's continue. Let's continue over here. I mean, I'm excited. I don't know what to expect. Oh, we're going to roll our car and there's a zombie right there. That would not be good. There's plenty of them right here. Okay. Hi, ma'am. Okay. Franklin Sorkin. Franklin must be feeling good. I mean, I fed him good. I gave him a bunch of food, a bunch of water. He, he's feeling good now. Oh, my gosh. There's a Meriwether weapons drop nearby. Running low on fuel, though, but we're almost almost near our destination. Uh, would it be better to get there right from the road or just go off-road from here? Oh, I can hear them fighting. That's not good. Okay, let's just continue. Let's go. Got this. Alright. So it should be just down here somewhere. I think we're gonna have to do some exploring. Oh my gosh. This is all overgrown. If you've played Grand Theft Auto, you know this area. You know this area right here. Everyone drives drives their cars through this. Their four-wheel drives. Four-wheel drive roleplay. <laughs> There's some better spots, but oh my gosh. Wow. And it is windy. Jeez, this is... This is crazy. Okay. We're gonna run out of fuel, but... I mean, there's a boat behind me and there's some abandoned cars around. Sure, we should be okay. I'm a little low on thirst and hunger. I'll quickly fill that up. I'll, I'll eat and drink quickly and then we'll... Then we'll go and explore. Because what they were saying is there's people here for us to meet, but I don't know if they're good or bad. So I'm kind of pretty concerned about that. Ben says hi. Hey, Ben. Hope you're doing well. Thanks for stopping by. Alright, I'm gonna hold out my shotgun and... Are you guys ready? You guys ready? Come on, let's go. We'll leave the car there for now. I mean, we got this if we need for later. Our other one's almost out of fuel and we don't have a jerry can, but... Is that it? Oh no, it's just a zombie. It's okay, it's okay. Alright, come on everyone. This is... freaking spooky. Oh my gosh. So the weird thing is, the coordinates that uh, my, uh, Franklin was speaking... Wait. Where's Michael and Franklin? Boys! Guys! Hello? Oh no, they're here, they're here, they're here. Oh, it's just hard to see him, but I can't see Michael. Oh, Michael's over there. I think they're having trouble navigating this area. Maybe they don't have the right shoes on for all this sogginess. But, uh, we'll just... Oh my gosh. This place is... I mean, it's kind of beautiful. I love nature and things being overgrown, but this is... Oh, runner. Where? Where? Oh, he's just gonna run out of the bushes like a wild animal, isn't he? I can't see the runner. I can't see my friends either. Where have they gone? Okay, this is getting creepy. We just need to do some exploring. So yeah, apparently we're here to meet some people? People. People. I'm not sure what to... Is that them? Yeah, they're not zombies. That's them. That's gotta be them. 
Looks like they're having a party and they got a boat. But yeah, what what are okay, we're gonna try and approach them. I'm not sure where Michael and Franklin are. Oh. Okay, they're still over there. Okay, we're gonna have to meet back up with them. Um But yeah, what I was saying was Franklin, he also spat out some other random numbers that they couldn't tie to like another full coordinate. So maybe there's like another place also. Oh my gosh, what is this? Is that like an old whale skeleton? That's cool. Okay. Okay, there's quite a few people here. Oh, these guys have guns. Well, so do I. But I mean like, I just... Surely they've seen me by now. You guys... You guys... You guys friendly? I'm here. Uh, Franklin... Franklin told me to come here. I'm not sure of the names of the other survivors, but we were told to come and meet you guys. Is this all good? Is that Lamar? No, it's not. Okay, I thought that was Lamar for a second. Okay, we're good. We're good. I'm going to go talk to these guys over here. You guys seem to be like the guards of this area. It's not safe. I feel like there'd be crocodiles around here and, uh, yeah, but I don't think many other survivors would be going through the swamp, so it's probably a good area. I mean, that's pretty decent. Good thinking. Okay, you got a bunch of... Okay. Okay, yeah, you got a bunch of drugs here. Right, okay. I'm not sure why you'd need to be packing them unless you're, like, planning to, like, move it to, like, some sort of island or something. <laughs> Obviously, I don't know who you're gonna be selling it to, so I'm not sure why you'd have it. Oh, there's a guy up here with binoculars, too. Where are you looking? Maybe they do have, like, an island or something. Anyway, I, I need- I need to have a talk to him. Alright, who- who's the- who's the main man around here? I was told to, uh, come in here and talk to you guys. You got a shirt that says Panic? I'm probably not going to want to talk to you just in case you freak out a bit. Yeah, are you the main guy? Alright, what, what's going on? Hmm. Alright. Okay. Well, uh, <laughs> they don't really seem to be saying much, but they said they uh, marked something on my map for me. And I don't know exactly how they did that, but... I mean, I can check it out. They said it was in one of the corners of the map that they just marked. So I guess we can go and see. One of the corners of the map. Doctor Who 10 says hi. Hey, Doctor Who. Is that the real Doctor Who? Is it really you, Doctor Who? Who else could it be, Doctor? Anyway. Okay, I think this is the area right here. One of the corners of the map. I mean, that's far. Where are we? All the way... Up here, okay. Uh, they're telling us that we should go and check it out and decide whether or not we want to come back. It's the only other thing they said. Is there anything else I need to know? I mean, you guys are... You guys are taking drugs over there by boat. Like, I'm not sure I want to go there. Because if I go there... Like, is there going to be people expecting me to have some sort of product when I arrive? And then I might get in trouble because I don't? Like, or is that your place? I'm not sure. All right. Okay. Well, they said we could take the boat. Uh, they're just going to sit here for a while. So what I'm going to have to do quickly, since Michael and Trevor aren't wanting to uh, come over here, I have to quickly just teleport forward to get them to get them to me. Hey, guys. Where's, uh, where's, where's Franklin? There he is. Okay. Guys, uh, we were told to hop in a boat and go to this place that, Franklin, you told people to go to. You, you're spitting out the coordinates while you're unconscious. Uh, from the last episode. Oh, wait, I just looted in the water? I'm trying to... I can loot the water for water! <laughs> I know that seems silly, but I didn't know. Okay, well, we're gonna have to get into this boat. It's gonna be a long journey, but I'm excited for this. Hopefully we can fit enough people. It's really me chilling in the... <laughs> It is. Who else could it be besides Doctor Who? I mean, he wouldn't lie. Okay. Alright, well, we do have fuel in this, and I don't want to run out of fuel, but we, we have to get from all the way here, all the way to this unknown place over here. Now, I'm not sure if these are just random little buildings, but I, I would assume in the ocean it would have to be some sort of island, and if, like, there's two markers, it must be a like, decently big island, so... I guess what would be our best way? We can go out through here. And go all the way around. Okay. Okay, this is gonna be a long trip. It's gonna be a long trip, and I hope... 
we're not going to have enough fuel, but we should be able to find other boats on the way. Hopefully. I mean, there might be one at the docks here. Worst comes to worst, we can grab a car and go over here and get, get to the docks, but I guess we better start now. All right. Well, well, well thank you guys for the help, and uh, I hope you're not setting me up. Because that, that would be really mean. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm not trying to ruin your boat, but I think I've just ruined your boat. No, no, it's good, it's good, it's good. <laughs> okay, okay. Trevor's just used to flying choppers, driving cars, and shooting guns. He's not experienced with boats. Alright, well, I guess, uh, I guess we're ready to go, guys. You guys ready? I can't see you, Franklin. There he is, top of his head. All right. Oh my gosh. There are so many zombies. But this is going to be cool. I mean, it's still rainy today. Uh, actually, oh, let me check one thing real quick. Okay, no, it's all good. It's all good. What is going to happen, though, is this boat has fuel. We got a long trip to go to this thing that I think is a giant island, which is going to be cool. Um, and it's getting dark. <laughs> I mean, it's 16.30 right now. It's going to be getting dark pretty soon, which is not good. We're out on the waters. I mean, we've got fuel and stuff, so we should be good. The zombies can't get us. I mean, we've got food and stuff, not fuel. I think I said fuel. So we've got enough supplies to survive if things do go wrong, but... Man, it could be bad. I'm going to stick to the shore just in case we do run out of fuel unexpectedly. We don't have to swim too far, but... We definitely have a long way to go. I mean, look at the pier. The pier's up there. We're gonna go all the way around to the other corner of the map. And I mean, we could go by car. But they told us specifically back there in the swampy area, we need to take the boat. I don't know why. I don't know if there's some sort of threat. Like, do people know about us now? Are we not supposed to go to this island? I mean, the more I hear about the island, the more I want to go, because I'm not sure what's there. But I'm kind of, kind of a bit scared about it. <laughs> Royal E, I was just watching your other video and I saw the stream. Hey, <laughs> thanks for stopping by. Perfect timing. I usually stream a few hours later. Um, right now it's about 1 in the morning for me. I usually stream about 4 in the morning. Because that's when most of my subscribers are awake. But I streamed a bit earlier because I'm, I'm a bit I'm a bit tired. So I thought I'd better stream before it gets a bit later. But yeah. While we're, while we're cruising here, let me just, uh, let me just have a sip of my coffee. <laughs> not gonna say it on stream ben for for people watching this as a video afterwards but who knows who knows <laughs> yeah we're gonna head over there i mean look at our fuel we started off with uh 0 0.9 fuel and now it's at zero point just under 0 0.8 0 0.79 not doing too bad but we still got quite a while to go i mean we gotta go actually we've We've covered some decent distance already. Uh, not really, actually. That's not that far. <laughs> yeah, well. We'll be right, we'll be right, we'll be right. See some more people stopping by right now. Hope you're all doing good. Thanks for, thanks for stopping, stopping by. Hopefully you enjoy. We've got some really cool stuff happening. If you're just stopping by now, and if you've watched like the first, second, and third episode, this is the fourth, and, uh... Oh, I thought that was like... A bunch of dead bodies in the water like zombies but yeah uh <laughs> you you don't have to but there, there was there's some pretty cool stuff and some good information at the start of this uh stream that you might want to check out but right now just a quick recap franklin and michael are alive they died in the last episode but it, they didn't end up actually being dead so we have them back we got some information from michael while he was unconscious he was he was like spitting out some weird gibberish uh, the people who rescued him and patched him up, made him all good, wrote down what he was saying, and that led us to some coordinates over there near Zancudo, which, like, there was people there, and they told us, we need to go to this island. They didn't tell us why, they told us to take the boat, not to go on vehicle, uh, on land vehicle or anything, we just have to specifically take the boat there. So it's a lot of mystery right now. Doctor Who, make sure your coffee don't go cold today. Were you the one in the <laughs> in uh, one of the older streams? Uh, I don't. I'm not sure which one it was. Uh, when my coffee went cold, you must have been, obviously. Yeah, it's already starting to go cold, but I put 
I usually drink black coffee. But uh, this time I got a little bit of milk and sugar in it. Just a little bit. But I put less in, less milk, so it's not going as cold as quick. Dragon Punch says, sup, sup, Dragon Punch. Reminds me of my nickname my brother gave me when I was probably like three or four years old. I don't remember it, obviously, I just heard about it. Everyone called me Dragon Fighter. No idea why. Anyway, our fuel is looking pretty good. As I said, we started off at uh, 0 0.9, now we're at just under 0 0.7. So we're not doing too bad. I think we may be able to make it there just on this one tank. By the way, everyone, is uh, is the audio levels fine? The game's not too loud or anything? I know my mic will be fine, but I'm not sure. I didn't do a test recording to see if the game sound was too loud or too, too soft. If it's too loud or too soft, let me know and I'll fix it up. Oh, man. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? It's a shame there's a zombie apocalypse happening. It's a shame, it's a shame. I don't even know if you can refuel boats with the jerry can. I'd assume you can. But we don't want to get our boat beached. Beached on the shore. <clears throat> and I mean, this is a pretty nice boat. I don't want to, don't really want to give this up. But if we have to, we'll pick up another one for the way there. I'm hoping... Uh, obviously, it's an island, okay? Well, what else would it be in the middle of the ocean? So I'm, I'm just going to assume it's an island. And I'm hoping there is other boats there. So when we need to come back... Well, we can. Because <laughs> otherwise we're stranded on an island that we have n no idea about and it's, it's not going to be good. All good. Glad to hear. Oh, man. It's going to be even spookier because we're getting there at night. It's the time now. All right. How close are we? I mean, we're getting closer. We started off all the way up here. I don't know. I still don't know why we were told not to not to take a car. Because the car could have been quicker. We could have been just over near the docks and taken a boat from there. But I don't know. I don't know. Maybe they got a tracker on the boat and they need to make sure that we definitely get there for some reason. I have no idea. Because this is their boat. It's not ours. I just hope it's not a setup. <laughs> All right, we're officially not heading toward any land anymore. So let's quickly check. Is this the right direction? Need to go a little bit more left. Just about over here. <sighs> Still got some decent fuel. All right. All right. Well, I think it's, think it's about time for another sip of coffee. And it's still raining. It's still raining. Really spooky, isn't it, Michael? You too, Franklin. I can't really see you besides the top of your head, but I know you're agreeing with me. It is pretty spooky. Look, we're leaving the city. Oh, man. One thing I'm concerned about is the size of this island. If it's big, and if it's got a lot of structures there, I'm assuming there'll be people. And in that case, are they zombified? Like, like have they been infected? I have no idea. And it's really scary. But we're getting further and further away from the city toward this island. And I just hope there's no zombies there. Well, if there is, it's good. Because we're going to need some extra resources. But man. Okay, we're going to be getting closer now. I just need to check. Am I definitely going the right direction? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. That good? Nope, more left. Okay. Okay. Oh, man. These waves are getting big, too. And it's starting to get pretty dark. What have we gotten ourselves into? I really hope we don't regret going to this island. And look at these waves. Look how beautiful the city is. If you're all the way out here and had no idea, you wouldn't think there's a zombie apocalypse going on. You'd just think, oh my gosh, look, we're right near Los Santos. You can see the whole of San Andreas from here. Man. Oh, we're getting some air. Alright. we got to be getting close. We are getting kind of low on fuel, though. 
which is kind of concerning me a bit. I'm a little bit worried about that. Not good, not good. Uh, but surely we're going to see something soon. It's got to be here, right? Yeah, it's not too far now. I think these waves are just slowing us down a little bit compared to the, just the flat, calm water we are on earlier. Yeah, it's getting quite hectic. It's a shame I didn't bring my fishing rod. Be cool to do a little bit of fishing on the way. I could give it to Michael or Franklin. I think I have two back at my base. I could have gave it to them and they could have could have stopped. Had a little, had a little bit of food and water. Stopped somewhere in the clear waters and uh, done some deep sea fishing. But it's alright. Oh. Okay. Strange. Oh. Is that it? That's got to be it, right? Look how far the city is away. Now the color of the sky has completely changed. It's gotten darker over here. Oh, it's getting spooky. Do we have a radio? Doesn't work. It doesn't work. It's not playing anything. I mean, there's no radio stations. All the people that control the radio stations are either surviving somewhere or dead and turned into zombies. So it makes sense, but okay, we're approaching the island. How big is this thing? Oh my god. Have you guys seen this? Wow. The moon's coming out over Los Santos and we're leaving it. Oh, all right. Well, I don't know where to start. I'm just going to head straight forward. Hopefully there's a decent enough place to park my boat. We got here on just enough fuel too. I mean, we have a little bit, but I don't know if that's a... It should... That fuel should be enough to get back to the city if need be, if things go, go kind of weird over here. Matthew Curtis, hey. Hey, Matthew. Hope you're doing well. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, man. How's your day going? Uh, it's been pretty good. Been pretty good. Most of it's been planning out this episode. Oh, we got another boat there anyway. Perfect. Perfect. But yeah, most of my day's been planning out this episode. It's, uh, just past one in the morning now here. My time. But other than that, it's been pretty, pretty good. I mean, is that boat going to drift away there? Might need to park it up further. Okay, it should be good here. The other boat's there anyway. I... Did you hear the shooting? I think you guys did. I love your videos. Hey, thank you, Matthew. You guys have no idea how much I appreciate it when I hear things like that. It really makes my day. My morning. In this case. Oh my gosh. I didn't expect there to be zombies out here. Uh, can you guys take care of the zombies quickly? I need a drink. I, I don't have much thirst. Okay, you, you guys do that. I, I'm going to quickly have some clean water. I don't have much clean water. Okay. Okay, we need to get out of these shrubs. I'm going to equip my shotgun quickly. Uh, we need to get onto like some clear land or something. Otherwise, yeah, these guys are going to pop out of nowhere. Oh my gosh! Are you kidding me? Oh, there are so many. There's so many. There's so many zombies. Oh my god. I've never seen this many zombies. Not even in the city. How many people were out here on this island? This is our first proper horde. Trevor, shoot. Oh my gosh. Uh, we're gonna need some transport really quickly because this is not good. This is not good. Uh, Matthew, how long have you been live for? Uh, 32 minutes. We've had some really good stuff at the start. Some good information and a whole explanation to how we ended up on this zombie field island. So feel free to, uh, stick by the stream and watch out the end or, or, uh, go back now and give it a look oh my gosh oh man there is so many there is so many uh, 
Okay, we're gonna have to start looting a couple of these. I, I, I cannot afford to... Oh my gosh. I cannot afford to uh, just leave all this these resources like laying around. You guys holding them off? I've never seen this many. This is absolutely insane. Oh my gosh. I know I keep saying the same thing, but this is just crazy. I've not seen this many. Guys, we need to get out of here. We need to move. We need to find somewhere safe. Uh, is any of these cars working? I don't have a vehicle repair kit, and I don't have time to quickly make one either. Is this car working? No. Oh. Just slow down the runners for now, and we'll keep going. Oh. Do you own a PS3? I don't, unfortunately. I don't own any console at the moment. I only own a PC. Um... I won't explain the whole story, but I had an old channel that was just about to hit 10,000 subscribers and it got terminated, unfortunately, um, because of basically a Gmail scam and YouTube couldn't do anything about it. And after that, I sold all my consoles because I was just upset that I lost all my hard work over the years. So yeah, only PC at the moment. I do plan to get uh, some consoles just for some other console exclusive games and things like that one day but for now yeah just pc oh man we need a safe place there's too many runners <laughs> this is insane oh my gosh God, can, can i please find like a safe place that's a two-door car but it's working but we need a f at least a three-door four-door uh, yeah, this, this is really bad. This is just real bad. Trevor, you might want to run. Oh, that's broken too. Oh man, this island. Why did they, why did they get us to go here? What was the point? I don't know if there's like something we need to find or something. But this is absolutely terrifying. Um, oh, I don't know where I'm going. I mean, if you guys can hold off the runners for long enough, I can quickly repair a vehicle. Guys! Uh, inventory. Vehicle repair kit. Okay, I mean, oh, that car's about to blow up. No, if that blows up, it's going to blow that one up too. We're going to have to go over here. Hopefully we have time. If I can repair one, then at least we can get somewhere safe. I just hope it's got decent fuel. This has by far been the most interesting episode so far. Okay, get in the car, get in the car. It's got some fuel. Everyone get in the car now. Quick, 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 quick. Our power's not working. I mean, the engine works, but we have no no headlights or anything. Okay, that's a dead end there. Okay, you can go over over there. Okay, okay, okay. We need to get out of here. We can't really get out of here because we're on an island, like, miles away from the city. There's nowhere to go besides on this island, so we just need to find somewhere safe at least. Just somewhere. Oh, man, how big is this place? Ghost Boy, hey, lo love you, zombie apocalypse. I literally watched from the first episode. Hey, thank you, Ghost Boy. Appreciate it. Hope you enjoy. Oh, you watched watch from the first, so I'm, I'm sure you're enjoying. So I'm glad you're enjoying. That's awesome. Oh, oh, there's a tower there. Oh, no, that's a water. Oh, there's a tower there. That one's a water tower, but this one we can actually get up on. Maybe we can set up like a tent and stuff there. If we set up a tent, we can sleep. And if we sleep, it'll be daytime soon. So I think what what we'll do is we'll try and block off the bottom here. And we'll just jump over for now. Come on, guys. We need to come up here, guys. You guys following? I don't know if they're following, but I need to set up a tent, like, ASAP. 
Uh, tent. Put your binoculars away, Trevor. I'm trying to set up a tent. Not much room up here for a tent, but it's alright. Gotta rotate it the right way. Okay, that'll that'll have to do, and we'll put down our fire so we can quickly cook some food and boil some water. Where's our fire? Where's our campfire? There. <sighs> I need to go and quickly check on these guys, make sure they're all good. Are you guys okay down here? They better not have died. Oh no, they're still there. They're still there. I just don't think they can get up. That's okay. Or maybe they're just like, Trevor, you go up there, you sleep, you cook the food. We'll stay down here and fight for now. We'll see you in the morning. I think that's what they're saying. I can't understand because the gunshots are just so loud, but yeah, we'll, we'll try. Go up here and sleep. If it lets us. It won't let us sleep if there's enemies around. No, we can't. We're gonna have to, uh... Gonna have to kill him. Okay, we're gonna have to go down and shoot the rest of them before we can sleep. Oh, man. I love how those zombies just do backflips with the shotgun. Yeah, it's so cool. Any more? Okay, I need to get over here. Quickly kill the rest. There's just so many, it's gonna be so hard to sleep. And I'm running low on shotgun ammo also. And I thought these guys had suppressors. Zombies are attracted to the sound of guns and well sounds in general. So this is this is not good. This is not good. I thought I told them to put their suppressors on. They must not bring them. They must have left them back at Franklin's house before we left. <sighs> Man, okay. Can we sleep now? Zombies nearby. They've marked them on the map. Okay. Where? How many? Just okay, three. Okay, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. There was one more somewhere. Just try. Zombies nearby. Ooh. Can we sleep now? One second. I'll reach out in a sec. I just want to quickly. Oh, this this is gonna be so hard. Okay, so we got two just to the left of me and two behind me. Get two to the left. Uh, that was just down there. Oh, it's gonna be impossible to sleep. Let me pick up my tent. We might have to sleep on the ground. Pick up a campfire too. We'll, he we'll head down. Uh, pull out the pistol. Otherwise, it's gonna be too hard. We're gonna get up here and more are just gonna spawn around and it's, it's gonna be impossible to sleep. Okay, let me quickly place my tent. Oh. Let me shoot, let me shoot game. Oh, there are so many. This is going to be just absolutely impossible to sleep. Might have to just wait it out till morning. They just, they just keep coming. What the hell? I have a machine gun? Okay. Uh... Oh, that's okay, Matthew. Use a car to block them. I, uh, if the, no matter where I am, like, it won't let me sleep unless I kill the zombies around the general area. Um, go to the mansion, block the front gate. Actually, that'd be a good idea. Yeah. But, actually, 
Remember, I don't know about this island, <laughs> so I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, is that good enough? Is that good enough? Everything seems quiet. There's still enemies nearby. Where, 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 where? Oh, they're pretty far away, though, game. I mean, it's morning anyway. It's morning. Let's place our tent. Uh, worry, hi, I'm a big fan of the series. Hey! Glad. Glad people are enjoying it. Um, I will place my... Where is it? Campfire. We just need to cook some, like, food, some extra food, and we definitely need to, uh, boil some water. Stop pulling out your binoculars, Trevor. Oh, we got plenty of water. There's other survivors here? Let's quickly drink. Let's cook some food, too. Uh, let's pick up the campfire. Oh, I'm gonna need to craft some stuff too. You guys quickly take care of the zombies. I really need to quickly craft some, uh... Oh, I've got a workbench already. Okay, perfect. You guys promise you'll, you'll take care of it all while I quickly craft some stuff? Do I have enough yet? Yeah, okay, I've got enough. Okay, okay, we're good. Let's quickly loot and uh, then figure out what the hell we're going to do from here. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> hey, thanks, Dark. Love your streams. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. I'm really glad people have been enjoying it. I mean, it's fun. I, I really enjoy doing them. Man, the weather seems to be just weirdly changing. And it hasn't stopped raining yet. We should definitely loot these guys though. We're definitely going to need the resources. What I was thinking was, if this island is... Like... Like if we're safe here, it'll be good. But... Like it'd be good for a base. We're safe here, zombies can't get here, at least from any other place. So if we killed off all the zombies, would be good. But I was also thinking in that case... Where are we going to get our resources? We're not going to have resources, so... If we end up killing all the zombies... Oh, oh my gosh! They're not friendly. Run and run before he gets up. Oh no, he's dead. Oh, I thought he had a machete sticking out of his head. What the hell is going on? You're in top two favorite YouTubers? Oh. I appreciate that. I really do. Thank you. That... Can't answer that, worry. It's a surprise. <laughs> you just hurt Michael. Leave him alone. Is he dead? Gotta make sure. Alright. Okay. Well, let's do some exploring then. I mean... Jeez. We didn't end up getting to sleep, so everyone here, me, Franklin, Michael, we're all kind of a bit worn out, sleep deprived. There's a hearse? Why is there a hearse? I bet you there's a body in that coffin. I would have no doubt about it. Maybe this island is kind of like a... Because they... If you remember, just the people who gave us, like, the coordinates for this area, not from Franklin, they... Franklin gave us coordinates to the people near Fort Zancudo in the swampy area, and they told us to come here. If you remember, just on that little little dock in the swamps, they had a bunch of drugs and stuff uh, ready to be ready to be put on the on the boat and taken to this island. So maybe there's like a drug lord's island or something. In that case, oh my god! Quick, help me! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. In that case, there could be a bunch of weapons and things like that around here, which would be really good, but... As I said, we can't stay on this island forever, because, uh... Yeah, it's gonna- it's gonna be quite hard. Once we kill off all the zombies, we're not gonna have any resources. I don't know if these guys have any seeds and things laying around, so I'm not sure if we can, like, grow our own food and stuff. We're definitely gonna have to go back to- back to the city. At one point. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But, I'm guessing it- it, it was good to come here, at least. Something new. Oh, there's some gates down there. You got a with me. And you're also the nicest YouTuber though. Hey, thank you. 
I mean, I try and read the chat as much as I can. Um, obviously, I don't get like hundreds or thousands of people watching, so it's easier to read the chat. And uh, yeah, whether or not people are not, there's more people still here. Even if people are being mean or, you know, being idiots in the chat, I'm still nice. Like, I, I, yeah, no need to be, to be mean or anything. Right, let's head through these gates. I have no- Michael, you need to stay here. I know you're all excited to go for fights and stuff, but we can't. We, we gotta keep- gotta keep moving right now. Okay, I need to switch to my pistol. I ran out of shotgun ammo already. Whew. Have you ever been camping bef uh, before? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been camping um, plenty of times. Not so much recently. When I was younger, I used to do a lot of camping when- when I could. I love it. I love it, I love it. <sighs> Just trying to get the headshots. <laughs> Royal E, I'm, I'm new here, I'm glad I found you. Hey. Well, I hope, uh, hope everything I bring out on this channel, you guys all enjoy. What am I doing? <laughs> I can't aim properly right now. My aim's usually pretty decent. So what's wrong with my aim? <laughs> There we go. Oh, there's like a party area down here. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's keep going. By the way, yeah, uh, I don't say this too often, but I do every now and then. I'm not trying to be that guy, but uh, yeah. If you haven't already and you are enjoying, I appreciate the likes if you want to leave a like. Just lets YouTube know that people are enjoying and YouTube's algorithm will be like, hey, people are enjoying this. So I might, I might put it on someone else's home feed and see if they want to enjoy it. So it's basically supporting me for free. We're going to quickly check out this area, see if there's any loot around here. Doesn't see. The, the other people that are here fighting. Uh, they're literally over there. I really need shotgun ammo. Um, I just don't know if I picked up any weapons parts. We're going to have to, going to have to check it out. Okay. Yeah. We're getting shotgun ammo. Shotgun is really important. I did have a, um, let me just keep spamming it. Do I have enough shotgun ammo now? I did have a suppressor on my shotgun, but it doesn't seem to be there anymore. So I'm going to have to craft one and put it on. There we go. Let's go first person mode for now. Okay, so I can hear a bunch of shooting over here. Let me quickly switch to switch to the sniper. Where are they? Go away, zombie. Oh, thanks. Oh, there's so many over there. Okay, we're gonna have to run in with a shotgun. Uh, can we get some high ground here? I don't think we can get up on that fence though. Over the fence, I mean. I don't want them to see me. I'm not sure if they can hear our bullets over the sound of theirs. Oh my gosh. Let's blow up this car and blow up the zombies. How cool will that be? Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> that, uh, that was too many zombies for that explosion and uh, caused a bit of an error with the mod there. <laughs> That's kind of funny though. Anyway. Uh, I have to go. Bye. Good luck with the stream. Hey, all good. Hope you enjoyed and uh, hope you enjoy whatever you're doing. Did you try Daisy? I I haven't. I haven't tried Daisy. I've seen it, but I, I haven't tried it. No. Do you have Snapchat? I don't. I don't use any social media besides um Twitter. I mean, I have other social medias. I just don't use them. Only Twitter. I'm out. Oh man, I just can't believe like how long we've been streaming. Fifty-two minutes. Probably about twenty minutes ago. 15 minutes ago on the start of this island how many zombies they were i've never i've never seen that many in this mod yet this mod i mean in this in, in, in the apocalypse i haven't seen it get this bad it was absolutely crazy i mean we could be all cool and hop in this car guys what do you guys think you think we should do it go old school on them i mean we can hear them fighting over there we can we can hop in and uh just drive them 
drop him down, run him over. Uh, after that little error with blowing up the zombies before, I think it, it caused a bit of an error, so I'm gonna quickly, I'm just gonna go save, and I'm gonna quickly have to, uh, reload the infection mode. There we go, we're good, we're good, we're good. Yeah, I apologize for that, it just has to be done, because the amount of zombies I blew up before just caused a strange error, and, uh, yeah, but it's all good, it'll be fine now. Okay, they're shooting over there. Where are they? Are they just behind this, uh... Yeah, they're just over there. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and ram them, ram them guys. Is that them? Pretty sure that was just zombies. Oh no, they're right there. Okay, they're hitting us. We're gonna have to get cover. I didn't expect so many survivors to be on this island. Park your car here. Get your guns out, boys. Let's go. You guys ready? What's going on with you, Nick? Where are they? Any more? Or was it just the one? Hey, Hi, zombie. Why is... Yeah, I apologize. That error we had before is making the zombies walk like normal NPCs. Which is really strange. I'm gonna try and fix that quickly. All right, here we go. Hi guys, we're back. We're all back. Everything's all good. Uh, while we're here, actually, just so we save, I better drop my tent. So, if we use the tent, that acts as a save place. So once we sleep, it's just like Minecraft. If you sleep in a bed, you know, that's where you, that's where you spawn next. So if I place that there and quickly just have a little bit of a nap, okay? It's been a bit. Oh fuck. Apologize for swearing. Try not to on the streams, but happens sometimes. Picked it up. I meant to sleep in it. Okay, there we go. There we go. Should I prank call someone? <laughs> I mean, if you want, happy to see your channel doing so good lately, mister. Hey, thank you, Anna. Thank you. I saw your subscribers going up a little bit too. I've been checking on them. I think you're at like nearly 580 you're at. Hey, Doctor Who, this is making me watch like Shaun of the Dead. I haven't watched. Ah, oh, Shaun of the Dead is so good. Let me uh, quickly pick up my tent and uh, I guess we can start. Start. Oh, the sun's going down. What do you think about the sun, Michael? It's going down. You dumbass. Uh, I got one too. Yeah, right. Well, boys, ready? I mean, we can take our vehicle. It's probably still got... Ooh. That looks interesting down there. But I wonder what's over here. Wait, wait, wait. Holster it. Oh, no, it's just some rocks. I thought there was a big building over there or something. Okay, we don't have much time before night time. It's going to get extremely dark. And uh, it's not going to be not going to be good. You should see how much I swear on my streams. I used to swear on my streams constantly and in my, video, in my videos too. But I try not to now because uh, uh, with these streams and stuff, there's a lot of... Um, there's people my age and stuff, but there's a lot of younger people also watching. I just try and keep it, keep it to a minimal. I want you to join him, but my mom won't let me. Oh, uh, you... The thing is, with this, you're not able to actually join in. So even if I wanted a friend to join in this, I can't. You can get a multiplayer mod. But yeah, I haven't got that set up. So unfortunately, no one... No one's able to join in on this. Yeah, I want to have a look around. Ooh. Okay, what we're going to do... Because it's, it's, it's getting night already. We need to sleep... So I'm going to quickly park my car here. We should have enough to craft some sand blocks and quickly make a... Um, make a... Yeah, there we go. There we go. Five sand blocks. Make a little area here. I guess we can stay in there as a little shelter for overnight. Don't need anything fancy right now. Just something to keep the zombies out. Everyone hop in. Come on, Michael. You too. Come on. Come on. Come on over. Come on. Good boys. <laughs> All right, well, a couple more, a couple more. Is that blocking off a uh, zombie? Oh no, they shouldn't be able to get in through there. Actually, we might as well use the last one anyway, so why not? 
Um, it's kind of silly to place it here, but we'll just do it anyway. We can pick it up later and keep it. Like, you have a join button next to the sub button. Oh, you want to join the channel. Okay, I get it, I get it, I get it. Yeah, um, joining the channel is like an extra way to support. It's just there as an option. People, please don't feel the need to. YouTube is completely free. Uh, if you want to support, just, just watch the streams and leave a like. And subscribe, of, of course. But an extra way to support for the people that want to is by joining the channel. And it's like, uh, I think think in Australian dollars like $4.99 a month and you get some extra stickers and stuff you can use in the chat and also a badge depending on how many months you've been a member um so that's just an extra way to support but don't don't feel bad Matthew I do not expect people to do that and uh yeah don't don't worry this is all good 14th Gemini streaming from South Africa nice well hello from Australia uh I'm gonna place my tent we definitely need to continue from the morning. It's gonna get quite hectic at night. Actually, we could do a little bit of night zombie hunting. Do you think? Oh, guys. I completely forgot. Obviously, we had that little issue where uh, I had to restart the game quickly. One thing I forgot to do was enable the zombies. <laughs> um, oh, we could turn off electricity. That would be scary. We will leave electricity on for now. Because we don't know this place and it'd be cool to figure things out. I think we do a little bit of bit of night zombie hunting. Michael, it's all good. You can trust me. I'm your friend. Oh, you really suck. <laughs> and Canada is $1.99. Oh, that's good. That's pretty good. I mean, you can choose your own price, but I, I think the minimum you can set it to is what I set it to. And you can have different tiers and stuff for other prices and stuff, but... I used to have that, but I think it's a bit unfair. I just try and keep it the same, so whoever does join the channel obviously gets the same perks as anyone else who joins. We should do some exploring. Are they coming with me? You guys coming? Come on down! What are they doing? Doesn't seem to be as many zombies around right now. There was earlier. There... <laughs> oh my gosh, the start when we got here was absolutely crazy. We're gonna have to pick up this sand block. You guys... Probably a little bit worn out after the near-death experiences uh, in the previous episode and all the zombies we hunted before, so I understand. It's all good. You don't have to jump over. Me, though, Trevor. I mean, I'm, I'm cool. I'm fine. My legs are fine. Look at me. You guys see that? Yeah. Anyway, not trying to flex my jumps and stuff. Do I donate? <laughs> no, Matthew. No, no, no. Don't donate, Matthew. It is all good. YouTube is completely free. As long as you enjoy the stream, that's, uh, that's the most important thing. Okay, there doesn't seem to be as many zombies at the moment. We killed a lot earlier. If my mum will let me. No, <laughs> Matthew, no, no, no. It's all good. It's all good. Don't you worry. Just, just watch the stream. Enjoy. Don't worry. I mean, what else? What else can we do here? We definitely have a lot of exploring to do. But if there's no zombies... There's no zombies at the moment. There's no resources. And if there's no resources, we are going to run low on food and water and everything like that. So in that case, we'd have to head back to to the city. Anna Banana, I'm heading to bed, mister. Go get those zombies. Catch you later. All right, Anna. Have a good night. Have a good sleep. And uh, see you next time. And yeah, we're going to get those zombies. I think we're going to have to go back to the city. There was a crazy amount earlier, but... Doesn't seem to be any at the at the moment. All right. Well, you guys think uh, we could take a nap for now, and uh, we get heading back to the city. Maybe. I mean, we're definitely coming back here another time. For now, though, if we can't get food and water from here from zombies, we're gonna end up dying, and uh, <laughs> we don't want that to happen. We 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 need to have food and water to survive, obviously. So yeah. I wonder, I wonder why they wanted us to sleep here. Sleep here. To visit here. <laughs> what am I talking about? Okay, it's early morning. Pick up a tent. Do you play Roblox? I don't, but I have. Years ago, with one of my friends, I played, played, um, played some Roblox. Mister, you seem tired. I probably look tired too. I mean, 
It's two in the morning for me right now. <laughs> and I've been awake since, I think, six, five or six in the morning the previous day. Ain't you looking? No fuel, no fuel, not good. Giles, Humphrey, Quinto, do you have all the, all the links of the mods there? I don't, um, the thing is, when I downloaded them all, I deleted the original zips after I installed, just so I don't get confused and stuff with my downloads, because I download a lot of stuff, for like thumbnails and games and, and things for content in general, so I just delete things afterwards. Um, but if you just, if you search up just Gesha, J-U-S-T-G-E-S-H-A, so just Gesha Zombie Survival. He has a tutorial, or not a tutorial, but he has a video that shows like 90% of the mods. He doesn't show how to install them, but all of the links for 90% of the ones that I've got in here are in the description, which is pretty cool. So that's where you get most of them. Uh, I need a vehicle repair kit. Go ahead and repair this. It's 9.57 a.m. for you. Our time zones are weird, hey? <clears throat> Excuse me. Time zones are strange. 10 in the morning for you and uh 2 yeah, in the morning you. for me. Fuck off. Now. Oh good, oh good guys. Hopefully exist? hopefully that helps you out. <laughs> Michael, put your finger away. Relax, Michael. Relax, relax, relax. Now where do we park our boat? We got an enemy behind us, gang vehicle. I think we parked our boat near the airfield somewhere over here, right? Parked our boat, you know what I mean, docked. Okay, so uh, I hope these enemies aren't chasing us, because I, I, I really want to get out of here. We need to get back to the city, and uh, we need to stock up on some loot, and we can probably go back to one of the bases. Uh, I think it was in the second episode we found a much, much different base. Oh, is this zombies up here now? Oh no, there's a weapons drop. Oh, we're going to have to turn around really quickly, this is really bad. Otherwise, we're going to get shot and killed. Oh, don't, don't mess up the car. Okay, hop out, everyone. Pull out my sniper. And we're going to take these guys out and get their drop. Oh, stupid fence. I don't even think they saw us. I don't know how. Okay, I think that was all, all of them, right? There's still one. Okay, I think we're good. Good shooting, guys. I gotta reload. <laughs> do, do I like or do I dislike? I mean, it's completely up to you. If you were enjoying the stream, leaving a like is much appreciated. But if if people don't like the stream, don't like something about it, that's what the dislike button's there for, but YouTube kind of removed the use for that. Doesn't show you how many dislikes anymore, but yeah, feel free, feel free to do what you wish. But you seem to be enjoying, based on the chats we've been having, so <laughs> yeah, like would be appreciated, thank you. Right. I guess it's good to get a bit of a drop before we leave this area anyway. What did we get? Nine items. Okay, that's good. Well, we, as you can see down the bottom right, thirst and hunger, a little bit low on that, so... Go ahead and uh, have some food. Running low on food. Okay, have one more water and we should be good. Now, take this car, seems a bit more beefy. Yeah, everyone watching at the moment, if, you, if you're if you enjoying, make sure to leave a like. Really, really appreciate it. I'm sure you have already, but... Yeah. It's just a free way to support the channel. It's free. Alright, friendly survivors nearby. I'm not sure about that. That kind of seems like a scam. Everyone I've met on this island so far has been extremely aggressive with their guns. Look at the city all the way over there. Wow. Wow. I pinned your message and I said, and it said I will see you soon. Yeah, that was just before the stream. Uh, when it was scheduled saying I'll see you soon. But I'm live now. Okay, so we've got a boat out there. I'm just hoping it has enough fuel. It should have enough to get back over there to the docks near our second proper base so we're gonna have to jump out and do some swimming when will i see you now <laughs> that message was uh for when i do go live and i'm live now guys how long have you been streaming uh one hour 15 minutes and 15 seconds yeah and these streams usually last 
Um, just under or just over two hours? You guys following me? Michael? Franklin? It's all good. I'll hop in the boat and I'll, I'll go over to him. Should be fine. Oh my god. I just can't believe how many zombies there were at the start of this episode. The start of the stream. On this little airfield there. That was... I just can't get over how many there were. I have not seen that many. In all of these episodes. Uh, you guys weren't... Oh, you guys are swimming slow. That's okay, that's okay. Come on. Up in, boys! Going on a trip! Let's go! Yeah, Franklin's in the boat with me and Michael's back there. But we will get Michael back over here. It's just, unfortunately, he's having a bit of an issue getting in, so... So once we get back to the docks over here, I'll get him back, I promise. I'll make him, I'll make him appear with Trevor's magic. That's all we're gonna have to do. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully everyone's enjoying the stream so far. I mean, this has been an extremely interesting stream. If you're dropping by just now, and you've watched like the first one, two, and three episodes, this is the fourth one. But if you've watched the first three, this, the start of this episode and everything up to now has been the most interesting things out of any episode we've done so far. This, this has to be my favorite episode. There's been so many cool things so far. It's, it has been absolutely awesome. I'm really happy with it. There's only two seats, many, that's why. No, people can sit in the back. And when we drove... Oh, wait. No, we had... Yeah, because we had a different boat earlier that held four people in total. People can't actually use them ones. That makes sense. Because the other boat we came here in, they all f could sit in. But that was slightly different. That was a Lampadaddy boat. And this is a... Uh... I forget what they call this one. We have a base just over here. Anyway, we can stop by. Which would be really cool. Yeah, we did get Franklin in the boat. But we couldn't get Michael in the boat. But we will, we will. We'll just stop over at our base over here. Which I believe is just around the right here. Which would be perfect. We've got our friendly survivors there. Everyone's all cool with us. Just hope there's not too much going on in terms of zombies. Oh, uh... I apologize. I forgot to uh, load our base. Oh, wow. It's a beautiful, beautiful day, isn't it? Look at this. In the ocean. Zombies in the top left. Wow. Okay, well, uh, yeah. Let's go and check out our base right here. Go back there. Hopefully everyone's doing all good. Seems everyone's going all good. Doesn't seem ruined or anything. Go from this ladder here. Come on, Michael, let's hop out. I mean, Trevor, we'll get Michael over here in a second. Oh, that was a fantastic dive. <laughs> that was amazing, Trevor. I'm surprised you did that in your the current clothing you're wearing, especially the backpack and everything. Like, that's got to be heavy. Oh, uh, excuse me, sir. Holy fuck, man. I'm sorry, but, like, who stands at the top of a ladder? Franklin, you don't need to attack those zombies just yet. Uh, we've got quite a few people watching. Let me just explain. I'm going to have to do a little bit of a cheat to get uh, Michael back with us because he didn't didn't get on the boat. So what we're going to have to quickly do is just do this. Okay, now we got Michael back. Okay, and we're back at base. Guys, you don't need to shoot them. Or are you shooting the zombies? Yeah, they're shooting the zombies. Okay, that's okay. I thought they were shooting the guards up here. You shouldn't be doing that. It's all good. It's all good. There's no more zombies right here. At least not directly here. Relax, Michael. Oh, there is. There's quite a few. Oh, even these guys are shooting. Okay, we've got to help them out. These are our friends at our base. We've got to kill the zombies. Boy, am I glad it's daytime, though. At nighttime, they're just so many runners. They just charge at you. It is horrifying. Oh, another one. Mohawk man. Jeez. Alright. Well, I guess we need some extra supplies and stuff, so we can can go ahead and do a little bit of zombie hunting for now. I'm just glad we got off that island. Anyone stopping by right now, I recommend uh, going back and watching from the start and just checking out what happened at the island. 
There was hundreds of zombies on the airfield on the on the island uh, we got told to go to. That was the most insane thing I've seen in any episode of the series so far. Whew. It was crazy. Beat the like. <laughs> I'm not reading that. <laughs> I hope that's not true, Matthew. <laughs> I appreciate what you're trying to say, though, but... <laughs> that's hilarious. Okay. Uh, no, it's not hilarious. It's hilarious if it's a joke. If it's not a joke, then that's not hilarious. Okay, I think we're good. We'll kill these two here. It is dandy, Trevor. Matthew, who did not beat me. Okay, okay, it's good. Well, in that case, yes, uh, beat the, beat the like button like my dad beats me. You know, if it was true, I guess, like... Oh, no, 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 don't worry. I'm not gonna make that joke. Have you tried 5M servers? Yeah, 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 I just... Uh, the only 5M servers I ever played was drift servers, because I enjoy... I enjoy the drift servers, that's all. Anyone wondering? A lot of people seem to think this is a server. This isn't. This is, um... This is just single player mods. Oh, there's still so many zombies. I'm just glad they're so passive during the day, but you still still do get the occasional runner. But at night, oh gosh, it gets insane. Okay, well, I'm glad we're back at base. Uh, where's... Where's Michael and... Trevor... Uh, Franklin gone. There's Franklin. Franklin, where's Michael? Oh, Ma you, you're here too. Okay. Okay, okay. I'm just filling up. Well, uh, I mean, geez, we've covered a lot this episode. What, what do we do? We've got a pretty decent base here. I guess we should set up our tent and quickly sleep so we can save here. It'll be a good idea for now. Everyone's still running crazy. You guys have a whole setup here. You got a bunch of men with weapons, guards, everything. It's because there's zombies in here. Oh, God. How, how did you guys let zombies in here? It's ridiculous. Anyway, let me let me put my tent down. Where's my tent? There's my tent. Okay. Place it over here. Seems like a decent spot for it right here, yeah? Yeah. And while we're here, we should probably cook some water and stuff, so... I'll put my, uh... Put my campfire down. Get nice and warm. It's been a cold day. A little bit of swimming. Everything. Oh, man. I just can't believe we actually got to that island and the amount of zombies. I keep saying it, but it's true. It was insane. It's absolutely insane. Clean water. Let's go ahead and cook it. Cooked meat. Hell yeah. Okay, we got, we got a decent amount of water. We need to eat and drink, though. So, we'll top them up. And I think we're good. And we'll go ahead and uh, go for a sleep. There are enemies nearby. I can't sleep. Oh... We're about oh okay we're gonna have to defend our base there's uh there's enemies out there oh franklin and michael don't seem to want to follow me out here so oh there's runners okay i don't like the runners Could just use my shotgun for now. I think I should. Why is there so many runners right now? I'm gonna need to kill these guys. These guys are trying to get into our base, but they're stuck with zombies at the moment. Is that all? Is that all the survivors? The enemy survivors, at least. Is there? No is there more? Are you still alive? Not anymore. Oh, nice weapon. Look at him eating. But you don't even care about me, you just want food. Well, loving the series so far. Hey, I'm glad. I'm glad I'm glad. Dot Dot just joined, didn't know you went live. Yeah, I think I went live, uh... I went live just after, or just before 1 a.m. my time, and now it's just after 2 a.m. So I've been streaming for an hour, hour and a half. I probably look extremely tired. I am, because it's 2 a.m. and I've had barely any sleep, like usual when I stream. <laughs> uh, 
but yeah. I mean, we've covered a lot of stuff. This episode has been amazing. Out of all the other episodes in this series, this has been my favorite by far. Another runner? Come on, man. Really gonna try that? What about you? You want some too, don't you? Oh, you really suck. Probably get demonetized for the amount of gore and stuff from this. <laughs> I haven't yet so far, so YouTube must know it's a game <laughs> and not too, too disgusting. But I mean, the, the gore mods and stuff have added, and the extra blood and stuff, pretty crazy. We'll continue looting for now. My dad left when I was two months old. I'm sorry to hear that. I, if it, if it makes anything any better, the first time I ever met my dad was when I was uh, 19 years old. It was the first time. He had never seen me, I had never seen him. Um, yeah, not going to get into that anyway, but... Yeah, don't feel alone or anything. It's all good. World War Z is also fun to play with zombies, yeah. Is World War Z based off the movie World War Z? Because I think the movie came first, right? I remember seeing the movie ages ago, years ago. I mean, I think we've looted enough for now. It's kind of starting to get a little dark. Sun's going down. Continue fighting a little bit of zombies for now. Do some extra looting. Oh my god, okay. Sorry, Mohawk man. You just gotta give me some space. Trevor, Mother F, and Phillips. Like, don't you know? <laughs> you guys are completely oblivious. Oh no. Okay, well, let's go. Oh. See, I told you. He just said it. <laughs> Alright, let's go back. Uh, craft what we can. We need to put down our crafting table so we can get some extra bullets and stuff how many uh, we're getting low on shotgun ammo we're good for sniper we don't use sniper as much probably need a little bit of um assault rifle the main weapons we use is sniper shotgun and pistol because pistols are good just for close range and long range headshots snipers obviously good for one shot kills on long range for like uh the enemy survivors that want to want to kill us and the shotgun is just good for zombies close range. So yeah, let's put our let's put our table down. Place it just over here with all of our other stuff, so we're good. Yeah, we're good. All right, now let's craft some shotgun ammo. Definitely, put your binoculars away, Trevor. It's not binocular time. It's shotgun ammo time. Need some assault rifle ammo too. I gotta change the bind for the binoculars. Um, I think we're good. That should be enough, right? Out of bullets. Okay. Now I quickly just uh save, 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 and uh, I'll also save the actual game itself. On top of that, I'm really happy with uh. How things have went this episode besides that one little issue where we had to restart the game but besides that everything has been everything's been great it's been real good you guys are still panicking all right and michael and franklin don't seem to want to leave from here they can't enter i don't know why uh but hey hey homie i trust you and all but oh you give me hives ah uh. Michael's got nothing to say. He, he knows I'm just kidding. You know, Trevor's a bit of a bit of a jokester, isn't he? <laughs> okay, you guys can't actually get through here. Uh, if you guys can't get through, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to assist you guys a little bit. So come over here. Actually, I'll drive the car to you. We'll hop in this car. This is our base. It's got a fuel full tank of fuel, basically. Actually, no, it doesn't. It says in the bottom left it does, but. On the right, in the little fuel numbers there, saying we don't have much, much, so I think the fuel gauge is lying. Up in Frankie. Up in Michael. Let's get out of here. It has been a tough day. It's been a tough day for all of us here. 
I'm just so intrigued by the island. I'm not sure. Bullshit. I agree. I should be able to drive through that. Ain't you looking? I am looking. It down. Are we really not going to be able to get through this? <laughs> okay, guys. I don't think we can actually get through that. If that's the case, gonna have to watch some magic. Wow. That was simple to drive through that. <laughs> Pretty cool. Anyway. <laughs> we are gonna head over back to our original base. This base is really good to have all these extra guards and stuff there to help us with, um... Of killing the zombies and surviving and stuff like that but we really really should have our own personal base for ourselves and these guys can hold this down we can like transfer supplies between each other and stuff like that come back check on each other and stuff but uh it's good to have bases obviously in the second episode i was saying um i want some more bases around just the map in general that way if things go wrong i need to fall back and get some extra weapons and stuff i can store weapons crate in, in different areas of the map in different bases so oh there's so many right here so that'll be a good idea we've already started with that so we've got a whole massive island that we still have to go back and like do more with eventually we got this base at the docks and another base at the airport and uh, actually, we had a base up in Sandy Shores, but I think we I think we dismantled everything and took it back and put it back in this base. Hostiles nearby? How close? Oh, not too close. If they get closer, we're going to have to fight them and take them out, but hopefully they don't. I just want to get home. Trevor, Michael, and Franklin, all of us, we've had a, had a busy, busy couple days here. It's been very stressful. Got sore hands from constant shooting of the guns. Let's just go home, relax a little bit. Have some nice food. Some fresh, clean water. It's a shame there's no radio stations. We might have to eventually... Go fuck just go to an old radio station and set it up. Because we can't seem to find any CD players or anything like that. Well, they've all been taken from the stores when the apocalypse first started. People just took them. All those people have died and we don't know where they they had them but uh you know michael franklin and trevor all of us here we, we wanted to just relax a little bit listen to some music listen to the radio but unfortunately yeah all the people at the radio stations have been killed or surviving so we're gonna have to try and set one of them up see if we can get it to run automatically all day just like a constant playlist on loop or something <laughs> Come on, come on, please. Hey, hey! Come on! Hey, fucking idiot! Uh, witchcraft. Uh, my mum said he looked like Gru. <laughs> Mister. Yes? What is a good post apocalyptic map like yours? This is just the normal map. Uh. Um. Oh, this is hard because I don't want to give away too much on stream because it'll ruin the story I've kind of built. But if you just look up islands, you'll be able to find some some cool things that you can you can add. Actually, we should drive this in. What I did accidentally remove, oops, that was an accident, is my gate. Really need a gate. Gates are important. Just like vegetables. <laughs> Feel like a, a parent. It's okay. I don't really eat my veggies, but I eat a lot of fruit. But gates are important, okay? Gates are more important. We need to set up our gate right here. Uh, we'll go ahead and place that, drive our car in, and then we'll go ahead and lock it. Mister, Mister, yes. What's going on, Matthew? Unfortunately, you have to get out of the car to lock the gate. That's okay. Uh, lock. There we go. Now, no one's going to be able to drive in. No zombies are going to be a walk in. It's completely locked. That's good. That's good. I'm glad about that. All right, everyone's in. Our car's a bit beaten up. That's okay. We did have other vehicles in here. Yeah, we got one of those military trucks right there, which is good. In case we find a bunch of other survivors that we need to take. If we need to go on like a big mission or something, it'll be really good. So we do have a tent here. We'll go ahead and sleep and save. <sighs> the good thing about this base we have right here, no problem sleeping. Most of the time, you have problems sleeping because... Zombies are nearby and it won't let you sleep. 
but zombies are never really too close here so we can sleep so it's really good we're gonna just sleep one more time that way it's a bit of a different time of day I'd like it to be daytime there we go early morning what's it like eight o'clock seven o'clock that's oh, 12 midday okay okay actually while we're here what's in our weapons crate what have we got nothing okay we'll give a uh, micro smg we have an ap pistol that would come in handy but we don't need that yet we do have a petrol can okay okay i'm gonna put quite a bit of stuff in here that we don't need i want to keep my bat we don't need the crowbar um don't need the assault smg i'll keep the smoke grenade just in case we need cover from enemies um advanced rifle assault rifle i'll throw away i'll throw away the advanced not throw away i'll put it in storage um and i think that's that's good that's all we really need like what we got what do we got left we got our shotgun which is good we got a baseball bat we got a sniper we got two assault rifles just in case and two pistols just in case and tear gas uh, it said it was smoke grenade, but oh well. Nealon. Nealon? Nealon. Uh, out of 10, how much do you rate GTA 5? Well, I mean, I, I would rate it a 10, but playability for me is not as much as it used to be because I played this game since it first came out, which I think was 2013, wasn't it? On the PS3? Came out in 2013, I think. And I've played it since then. I played it on like the new gen consoles, the old gen and PC. Like I've played this game a lot. That's why I'm doing stuff like this instead. So, uh, I played too much of it to the point where things get boring fast. So I I'd still rate it a 10 for people who've never played it or people who have like, you know, just getting into it. I think GTA in general is an absolutely great game and still holds up to this day compared to other modern games that came out recently. Considering an old game, like, there's just so many things you can do. So, yeah, I'd still rate it a 10. <clears throat> um, Alright, are we running low on anything else? Do we need anything else? We've got good pistol ammo. Got de We do need a little bit more shotgun ammo, actually. Um... Put your binoculars away, Trevor. Is that enough shotgun ammo? Didn't give us any more. Strange. Should have. Uh, I didn't shoot. I don't know why it did. It's not giving me extra shotgun ammo. Yeah, there we go. No, no. Okay, it's not giving me shotgun ammo. <laughs> That's okay. We'll fix it up next time. Okay, uh, what do you guys think we should do, huh? Why, why you drowned at birth? What should we do? Should we... Should we head out and kill some zombies, extra supplies and stuff? Idiot. Actually, we need a jerry can, don't we? Said we had one, but... We don't actually have one. So I think that would be a good idea. We can go... Go and get a jerry can. That'll be good. You can do anything in GTA. Yeah, it's it's really good. It's really good. Even if you're just brand new to like GTA Online, once you're a couple levels, like it's a free world. Do whatever you want. The sea looks so good, it almost takes him out of the apocalypse. It does, it does, it's beautiful. I think I was saying that when we we're heading over to the other island. Mr. <laughs> Mr. Yes, Matthew. I'm here, I'm reading. Mr. 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 Yes. <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> Come on, boys, let's go. I unlocked the gate. Why isn't it <laughs> working? Come on. That should be working. Come on. Our gate is not working. Oh, I'm sorry, Franklin. <laughs> A gate is not working, so I apologize. Uh, wow. Wait, 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 our gate works. Okay, uh, we need to go find an extra jerry can for some spare fuel for later on. So we will head to a fuel station. See what we can find. <laughs> Try it outside the gate. Yeah, I probably should have. I don't know. But yeah, what's what's going on, Matthew? 
keep saying mister. I'm here, I'm reading, but you haven't typed anything else. Everything all good? Alright, we'll head to whatever the closest gas station is that we can find. There's Trevor's car. No, it's not, actually. I thought it was for a second. It's not. <laughs> it's the same color. And it's still raining. Has it still been raining this whole time? I think it stopped over on the island, but it started up again. Thanks, guys. The guys just can, like, cheered me on for the jump. Thanks. Usually you guys are... Oh, we just ran out of fuel. Not good. <sighs> All right. It's so on foot for now, then. I guess uh, we'll find the nearest gas station and uh, come back to that car. Unless we find a, another good car. We've been just swapping cars constantly. Constantly. Trevor's car is at the strip club. I mean, it, it could be... But if you're talking about like on your game it's at the strip club, that'll just be where where it is for your game. Um I've seen Trevor's car a few times in this series. It's just in random places a lot of the time. I need to eat though and drink quickly. Uh we'll eat some packaged food. That'll that'll be good. We could save our cooked meat. Have some water. I probably eat dr eat and drink too much than I like, more than I need. You know. Get a little bit thirsty. Not you when you're hungry. No, I saw it in, saw it in F3, F2. Oh, okay. Oh, man. Well, there's a fuel station just over here. We can get that and then take it back to our other car. Oh, but then we're going to need a spare jerry can for later. Because we need to use this one to fill up the car so we can get back to base. Okay. Lucky there was only one runner. There's quite a few zombies here, though. Alright, let's keep going. Try and avoid the zombies if we can. No need to waste ammo. No need to waste ammo right now. I mean, we got some decent resources, so... When we're running low on resources, we can go back and go on a massive zombie hunt. Zombie hunt. Like, uh... Excuse me. <laughs> I apologize for that. Uh, like on... I think it was episode 2. We did a big zombie hunt. So we've got the fuel can, Joe can. And uh, let's go ahead and loot the shelves. We can get some extra packaged food and clean water from here too, I think. So that'll be good. That'll be good. Oh, guys don't need to shoot the zombies just yet. It's all good. <laughs> it's hard to clear my throat. Uh, okay, I've looted most of it. Oh, jeez. I can hear a runner somewhere. You know what, guys? Watch out, guys. Watch out. I had to do it. I had to do it. Caused a lot of noise. They're all going to come over here now, though. That's, actually, that's a bad idea. But it's cool. It was, it was cinematic, right? It looked like it was from a movie, yeah? Oh, my gosh. Oh, this is not good. They're all running in. Ma'am. Get on the floor. Is everything cool? Everything good? Everyone, everyone good? John and Lisa. Guys need to relax. Oh, well that was uh, absolutely insane. <laughs> Jester's sketchbook. Hey, good to see you here, Jester. If that's your name, unless it's just your sketchbook. <clears throat> Sorry for clearing my throat. Got sinus problems, right? All right, and you're still up, ma'am. Get away, guys! You're gonna blow up the thing if you keep shooting her. You need to be careful where you're shooting. You don't want to blow me up. If you shoot this, I'm dead. Oh, there's another jerry can there too. Can I carry two? I can't. Is there a car I can fuel up around here? If there is, we can put put some fuel in a car, fill it up full. Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, there's a lot of cars right here at the mall. We can use we can use the fuel the jerry can we have right now to fill uh fill one of these cars up and then take the the other one for a spare. That'll be perfect. We just need to find whatever car is probably like the best. Probably this one actually. These are all working too. How much fuel's it got? Almost full. I can store one thing at a time. 
Okay, I can store one thing at a time in the boot. You're supposed to be able to store more, but it won't let me. So what I can do... After I kill these zombies... Okay. Oop. Uh, how do I put item Q? Oh! And then I should be able to pick up this one. Yeah? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we have one and there's one in the boot. It says it's on the ground, but it should just be in the boot. Okay. Uh, Danush, good to see you back here. Wow, how did uh, Franklin come alive? If you watch, it, it's completely up to you, but I'd recommend going back to the start of the stream, whether it's after I end the stream or right now, completely up to you. Because there is a lot of information and a lot of, a lot of things that happened and... <laughs> Yeah, Trevor and Michael are actually both back, and they're not just randomly spawned in. There's actually a story behind it. They, they, they both, uh, they both were actually alive. They, they didn't actually die. To quickly sum it up, Franklin was not actually dead in the first place. We thought he was, and uh, we had to leave, obviously, because it's not really much we could do. But he got brought back to us by uh, friendly survivors who fixed him up, and Frank, uh, Michael, he never actually drowned. It was a joke because he was a professional freediver and he was just holding his breath trying to trying to make me laugh, Trevor, because because uh, Franklin passed. And unfortunately, fortunately, I mean, uh, yeah, none of them were actually dead. It was really good. Matthew, Mr. 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 Love you. <laughs> Thank you, Matthew. Love you too. Love all you guys. All 15 of you right now. Yeah, thank you everyone for all the support on the, the series in general. At the, oh my gosh, I shouldn't have done that. I, I just, I forgot I'm in a zombie apocalypse and I just, just my, it's just an instinct to hit a, hit a nice stunt, you know? Actually, why not? It's a zombie apocalypse, but sometimes you gotta have fun. You gotta have some fun, right? You hit that jump. Yeah, I did, Michael. Did you hear him cheer me on? <laughs> Constant rain suits the apocalypse. Yeah, I, the funny thing is I didn't even change this. It was raining at the start of the episode, then it stopped like when we were heading toward the island. Uh, yeah, just a sketchbook. There was some crazy stuff at the start, and we had a whole massive journey to a completely different island all the way over here. And it's a massive island, and it's the biggest zombie hordes and attacks from zombies that I've ever seen in any of these episodes. So, yeah, you should go back and watch that. It was absolutely insane. I haven't seen anything like it yet. Is by far my favorite episode out of all episodes so far. Our car is really banged up, but at least we got a, got a spare jerry can. I think we did have a jerry can when we put one in here. Like it, it said we had one in here. Do we? Petrol can, yeah. And we have one in in our inventory right there. Oh. Oh yeah, just one. And we should have one in the boot also. Yeah, one, one in the boot right there. Perfect. Oh, wait. It says invalid. Let me... Okay, well, we're gonna have to refuel this. Anyway, so let's quickly refuel, then I'll check if I can take the one out of the boot. I hope I can. I'll need to. Worry DV. Hi, I'm back. Hey, welcome back. Hope you're doing... The good. <laughs> my words? What are... What even are my words at the moment? Just a reminder, yeah. It's, uh, it's past 2 a.m. It's like 2.30 in the morning or something, and... I've had barely any sleep, like usual, so <laughs> I'm messing up words, like usual. Just a sketchbook I'll be rewatching for sure. Oh, it was, it was awesome. Like, I'm not even just saying this, like, the amount of things that happened in this episode was awesome, especially, um, can I take it? Yeah, I can. Okay, that that's great. Especially the island and the story leading up to it. It was, it was cool. Okay, we'll go ahead and, uh, probably not walk around a fire with a jerry can, Trevor, but we'll go ahead and quickly sleep in the tent i mean it's it's getting close to night so yeah <laughs> mr 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 yes matthew <laughs> uh 
I'm new here, but you have gone have you gone to the military base? We were near there at the start of this episode. In the old zombie series, I did go to the military base, but it was a bit weird because I found a minigun, which is a, a bit overpowered for a zombie apocalypse. <laughs> Seems like cheating just finding a minigun instantly. <laughs> yes, Matthew. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Matthew. <laughs> In Belgium, it is not morning. Yeah, it's, uh... What time is it here right now? 2.41. Getting close to 3 a.m. Yeah, we've been streaming for almost two hours now. And I usually keep these just over or just under two hours. Just so the people who watch them as episodes after the streams, they just watch them as videos. I don't want to keep it too long for them. I want to keep it... Keep it long enough to where it's... You can enjoy it, but it doesn't become too boring. But not too long to where it becomes boring, yeah. Uh, but yeah. Well, I think that is going to do for this episode. I mean, I'm, I'm getting tired. I probably look, probably look tired. I think I, I, I think I look really tired. <laughs> probably. <laughs> yes. Hi. Hi, Matthew. <laughs> you, uh, you will not want to be up at 3.30, 3am. No. No, I won't. I usually am anyway. I mean, if I go to bed now, I'm going to probably end up sleep i have horrible sleep that's why most of my streams are at like 4 a.m and i have had no sleep anyway so if i try and sleep straight after this it'll probably take me two or three hours to get to sleep anyway so i'll probably go to bed at like six or seven in the morning but yeah thank you everyone for stopping by we've had quite a few people stop by the stream we've got 12 people still watching right now even though i'm about to end it's good that's cool hopefully everyone enjoyed for those who just stopped by recently feel free to go back to the start of the stream there's as i was saying there's some absolutely crazy stuff that happened it was really good it was really good i really enjoyed this episode by far out of the other ones because the kabuki man will come out and s suck your toes <laughs> well he's not in luck i don't have toes i do i have toes i have toes i have 10 i have 12 toes Anyway, well, uh, yeah, thank you everyone for stopping by and hopefully everyone enjoyed. Once again, as I said, people just stopping by now. Feel free to go back and uh, watch from the start. This episode's been crazy, but yeah. Me, Trevor, Franklin, we're all going to get to get some sleep. Not together. I mean, we got extra tents, okay? You just can't see them. That one's just for one of us. Don't get the wrong idea, right? <laughs> all right. Well, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for stopping by, and hopefully hopefully everyone's doing well. Had a really fun stream. Yeah. Alrighty. Just a sketchbook, not together. Yeah. <laughs> maybe. Maybe. Depends. 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 Probably not together, because Trevor keeps uh, blowing stuff out of his nose, and it's kind of gross, so these guys probably want to sleep separately. I probably would, too. Yeah. Hey, don't be sad, Matthew. It's all good. It's all good. Catch me next time. It's all good. I hope you're doing well. Hope you hope you have a good rest of your day. It's only morning for you. Have some food. Have some breakfast. <laughs> but yeah. Anyway, all right. Uh, as always, I'm gonna end the stream now. Otherwise, I'll I'll never end it because I don't like ending streams. I feel bad. I want to keep talking to you guys. But if I don't do it, I will never do it. <laughs> I'll just keep talking. So, yeah. All right. I'm I'm sorry, Matthew. I'm sorry. I gotta go. It's really early in the morning for me. I'm getting tired. Got to start relaxing a bit. But yeah. All right. I'll see you guys. <laughs> I'm your dad. Okay. Well, uh, if I'm your dad, I make the rules. You, you have a good day, Matthew. You have a good day. You eat some good food, healthy food. You can have some snacks too. And uh, I'm going to go to bed. And I'll see you shortly for the next stream. <laughs> Love the series, dude. Thank you, Jester. Anyway, I'm going to go. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you all. And uh, yeah, stay happy, healthy, and hydrated. Bye-bye. Don't be sad. It's all good. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> all right. Bye-bye. 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 Thank you.